Hi, now we are going to discuss about harmonic oscillator. Okay, so it is very important uh, in the point of uh, CSIR and gate examinations. Okay, right. So now, how a harmonic oscillator arises? Okay, so harmonic oscillation arises if a system contains. So consider a pendulum or a spring. Okay, a system. Uh, contains a part that experiences a, a restoring force proportional to the displacement uh, from equilibrium so consider this is an equilibrium position of this uh, spring okay so and uh, it is uh, uh, so it has some restoring force okay and it is proportional to displacement uh, from its equilibrium so consider this is an equilibrium position so equilibrium from the equilibrium position so by stretching so it uh, displaces from its equilibrium position to x distance and if it gets a uh, uh, compressed it gets uh, x uh, that means uh, distance x from its equilibrium position okay right at uh, the same time uh, as like that if you observe the pendulum so this is equilibrium position of the pendulum so if uh, when oscillations occur so what happens so the distance there is x and uh, from here to here x okay so uh, always the restoring force of uh, the pot that means the pendulum or the spring at, um, is directly proportional to a displacement from equilibrium positions okay so this is given by hooke's law so that is f is equal to we know that minus k x square okay minus k x square so in this uh, hooke's uh, law k represents a force constant okay force constant right so if a spring that means a stiff spring has a large force constant that means if the uh, spring is very stiff so then it has a large force constant if the spring is a weak then its force constant is a weak one that means a less or smaller one okay right so because the force acting on a particle so the force acting on a particle is a negative gradient of potential energy so that is given by f equals to minus dv by dx okay so it follows that potential energy of the oscillation varies with displacement x from the equilibrium so it always the potential energy always uh, always varies from uh, its equilibrium position to displacement x okay so in this way that means uh, from here to here or here to here always the potential energy changes that means at equilibrium potential changes uh, potential ch uh, potential energy is more that means infinite but when the displacements occur so the potential energy varies from uh, here equilibrium position to displacement x or here to here or here to here or here to here okay so that uh, that's why the potential energy of a displacement with displacement x is given by the formula vx equals to of k into x square okay and uh, the hamiltonian operator for harmonic oscillator is given as h is equal to minus h cross square by 2m into d square by dx square plus half into kx square so this is a uh, potential energy of harmonic oscillator okay right and the schrodinger equation the schrodinger equation is given for um, harmonic oscillator harmonic oscillator as minus h cross square by 2m into d square by dx square plus half into kx square half into kx square into psi equals to e psi so this is the uh, schrodinger equation for a sim, uh, simple harmonic uh, 